We begin with breaking news. Traffic chaos on the roads. Less than two hours ago, a major stretch of the 215 was shut down for a road project, and it's causing gridlock on surface streets and the airport connector. But this is just the beginning. Tonight, 13 Action News road warrior Brian Callahan is out in the thick of it in our live drive unit. So, Brian, how's it going out there? Well, actually, very slow going. We're eastbound heading toward the airport connector. You can see a lot of people not getting the message about this weekend's closure. That will remain in place until Monday morning. Our first time through this section, it took us 30 minutes to make it back towards the Henderson end because of this closure. So we decided to test out some detours for you. If you're heading east towards Henderson on the 215, your best options are to get off at either Jones, Decatur, or Las Vegas Boulevard, then take them down to Warm Springs where you can get back on the 215. All three of those took us between 9 and 11 minutes. Now, if you're heading the opposite direction west, the best option is to get off at Windmill, then make your way to the 15 and get back onto the 215 from there. That took us just 8 minutes. That's compared to 10 minutes if you got off on Warm Springs and made your way back to Decatur. Now, as you can see here, all the brake lights out here. If you're trying to head towards Henderson from the 15, your best bet is to go Blue Diamond or St. Rose exits there. It's also important to note that as you see here, you can still get to the airport on the 215 despite the closure, but things are going really slowly here. As I said, it took us about 30 minutes to make it through there the first time, so you may want to consider using Russell Road or Paradise if you have to drop somebody off or pick somebody up at the airport. Reporting in Live Drive, Brian Callahan, 13 Action News. And here's a look at our traffic map in real time. What you see in purple is shut down right now. All of the red and orange is a major backup. Now let's roll through some of our other traffic cameras, Steve. These are live pictures. Uh, this is uh, west of Las Vegas Boulevard. You can see this is the uh, 215 there, that interchange going into the airport. Uh, also, uh, let's move along here so we can get, get everybody an idea of what's happening. Uh, again, the slowdowns, this is at Gillespie. This is a widespread situation. And uh, the, next, uh, the next traffic camera is going to show the same thing. This is uh, sort of a longer view uh, of the 215 uh, 15 interchange southbound. So you can see it's, uh, it's affecting traffic going in, uh, in a number of directions. So as we said, this will be happening through the weekend. So we've dedicated an entire web page to help you get through this. You can find the closure maps and the alternate routes at ktnv.com and click on the traffic link up there at the top of our homepage.